the scattered glimpse of the crowd that is here at Safari Farm Stadium in Sarani. Of course, the moment suffering in terms of numbers, the Safari Summon that is. It has drawn bigger crowds in days gone by. In 2013, this stadium was about 25,000 full. But of course, a dwindling spiral of bookings there. We've seen low crowd attendance. Probably questions that the hosts, Kenya Rugby Union, will have to ask themselves in coming days. But for now, the action continues in the Africa Cup Sevens. This is the seventh place playoff between Morocco and Nigeria. Nigeria in the green strip. Morocco in the red and green strip. picture there the man in the dyed hair looking like that musician Cisco from the group Drew Hill that is Collins Mulindwa all the way from Kampala Uganda you ready? and I'm sure the likes of Ramzi Olinga, Peter Ofong watching this match, Sam Nikoma watching this match in Kampala of course they do know that man very well knock on advantage This looks like an early concern for Nigeria early on. This is Okafor Sopuruchi Tha. Just walking gingerly there after finding himself in contact. Pushing up, ball must get there. Don't push the ball is down. The scrum putting is Let's go crowd. for Bye. Morocco. Morocco semi-finalist at last year's Africa Cup Sevens, which also doubled up as the African Olympic qualifiers. Starting this match with intent. And they break the deadlock here. The man who goes over for the first try is that man in shirt, number seven. Yields Lamarti. Goes over for that try. Morocco breaking the deadlock here. 5-0 anyway, with the conversion, the conversion to come. Take your time. Nigeria. Adla. Conversion is unsuccessful. The scores remain 5-0. The man who attempted the conversion is Robin Pellet. That was the moment Yields Lamarti just broke through yeah. that tackle yeah. from Samaila Nuhu Ibrahim. The restart is stopped back by the Moroccans, yeah. eventually securing yeah. it. Yeah, back. Just looking to get play going. Morocco took part in the Olympic Games repechage in Monaco. Of course, they were not lucky. Failing to qualify from that tournament, which was won by Spain. In fact, the man who won it for Spain was Ignacio Martin, and he will be in action later on this evening with Samurai International. He got down. He was part of the Samurai International squad that won last year's Safari Sevens. But this is action in the Africa Cup Sevens. It continues, and that was Ekpo Samuel. Nigeria just looking to get the ball to work for them. Deciding Dakla to go way, it Dakla alone. Dakla way. Was that the best of Back. decisions to make? This is full flight from Ladipo Olaitan. And he goes over. Well, he thought he did. The referee had called for an infringement. Yes, he had okay. a foot out into touch. La Depot Olaitan. 
He has been the go-to guy for the Black Stallions. Wait for me. Wait for me. Mark is here. Close in. There is an injury to a Moroccan player. Under straight ball when you're ready. And that was the imposing frame of Mohamed Abid. We'll just find out whether he has bid the tournament farewell. Meanwhile, this is elusive running coming through from Maxim Peret. But Nigeria finding themselves in possession. This is Iheme Chidera. He steps and scores under the posts. It is five all. Well worked individual try there from Iheme Chidera. The conversion is successful. Nigeria going ahead for the first time in this game. Seven points to five. We still have two minutes, 23 seconds to play in the first half. And this was that moment. Chidera just found himself in possession. Let's just see this. Steps through one, two, that change of direction, three, and then doing the easiest of jobs, grounding the ball for that try. It was eventually converted. Nigeria now in the lead by seven points to five. This is the seventh place playoff at the Africa Cup sevens. The ball. He runs back claimed there from the restart by Morocco just looking to keep it alive there that is a beautiful interplay there from the Moroccans letting the ball work for them as they try to exploit any space any gap that may arise in the Nigerian defense this is good continuity there and it is that man who is back on the pitch Mohamed Abid. Cortin Mekdi just shrugged off that tackle. And this is the man who looks like the most enterprising player thus far, Maxim Peret. The chip was not accurately delivered. Possession is turned over, and it is Nigeria. We've seen them already go 7-5 ahead. They're asking questions of the Moroccans. This game is bubbling into life, looking a lot more lively than the match we witnessed earlier. The match for 11th place. And the ball has been stolen and turned over. And Olaitan is going to race clear. A second try for the Nigerians under the post. Of course, making the conversion a lot more easier. Nigeria 12, Morocco 5 as the first half. Still has about 20 six seconds remaining wait 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 It is half time and the scores are 14 5 in favor of Nigeria. Sam Nikoma is watching this action all the way in Kampala, of course, eagerly awaiting the Africa Cup 7s final between Uganda and Namibia. Let's go into half time. Just keep playing white. You are playing well, man. Keep the composure. Keep the 
Using this what? Using this. I'm using this, not that. You ready? As we brace ourselves for the second half <laughs> of the seventh place playoff between Nigeria and Morocco, it is Nigeria holding a 14 5 lead. Morocco went ahead, but two tries from the Nigerians. Both of them converted, oh, yeah. seeing them holding the 14-5 lead here. This head, is eh? the action oh, coming to you on Zuku Sports, uh, streaming to you on zuku.co.k slash live, on facebook.com slash Zuku Official. Of course, you can watch the action in Kenya, Uganda, and the rest of the world. And I'm sure there'll be many Ugandan eyes for the cup final between the rugby cranes and Namibia. The ball is kept alive by the Nigerians. They have looked the more sprightly side here. It was after this. That was Chidera. Remember, he scored the opening try before Olaitan added the second to extend the lead for the Nigerians. They will be looking to add another try and just put daylight between them and the Moroccans. Mark is here. This is the mark. Okay? Ball. Remember, you can talk about the rugby tournament, the Africa Cup Sevens, using the hashtag at the lower right corner of your screen, the Africa Cup Sevens. Just plug into the conversation on social media using that hashtag. But play continues here, and this is carried into space okay, there by away. Ogar Enoch. The ball is presented. That was. Oekan Mikaze just losing his footing for a moment. The try scorer, Ladipo Olaitan, he is a big unit and he fancies himself for pace. That tackle looked high from Oekan Mikaze, Collins Mulindwa. We are playing against him again, right? Yeah. Not about fighting, it's not a war. No problem. I don't want to end the again, okay? Oh That's yeah. the first one for me. I don't want to say it again. Okay. Awards the penalty to the Moroccans, and I just told something about Collins Mulindo's hairstyle. Of course, they say imitation is the best form of flattery, and of course, picking up something from an athlete in a sport that is related to football, that is to rugby, that is football, that is Paul Pogba. But for now, the action is rugby related. Collins Mulindo just making sure everything is in order at that line out. Line out throw for Morocco. I filed the report. Line out, come down. Made a hash of that line out throw. From here. No pushing at set, just set and wait for the ball. Crouch. Bind. You know where you're going? You're going out, you're going out. Stay there, okay? okay? Crouch. Bind. Set. Hold it there, hold. You <laughs> Well, 
Well, that was interesting from the Nigerians, but eventually the referee calls for that handling error. It remains close, 14 points to five. Remember, the Moroccans need to score twice to win this one. They still have half of the second half to do so. Well, actually now about two minutes, 55 seconds. Crouch. Sit. Sit. And just going through Sit. previous matches in Out. the Africa Cup Sevens on day two. We saw Botswana earlier on defeat Mauritius 24-21. Zambia fell to a 24-14 loss at the hands of Senegal. But this is looking promising for the Nigerians. Will this be the try that puts daylight between them and the Moroccans? Breaking into a dance there is Okafor Fa just doing the dub there. The try extends the lead. Nineteen five, and you just feel at this point in time we still do have about two minutes to play. It will now take Morocco three touchdowns to win this game. That is assuming that the Nigerians do not convert this try. And the conversion is unsuccessful. The scores remain 19 points to five in favor of Nigeria. And this was a moment Fa just pouncing on that loose ball. And just did enough there to get away Morocco. from his Moroccan marker, Yields Lamarti. Goes over for the try. The restart there is high. The contest is messy. There was a handling error, but Mulindo are playing that advantage. Morocco now in possession. What can they do from this? They have one minute, ten seconds to go. Step into space there. Looking to keep the ball alive. We saw Morocco start this game brightly. Back, Nigeria, Nigeria, back. But they've since faded into oblivion. <laughs> Let's take the first one. <laughs> and just see the Nigerian players remonstrating okay. there. Collins Mulindwa calls for the scrum down. 38 seconds to play. Nigeria comfortably ahead in this one. You can see the animation on the Nigerian bench. Yeah. Just acknowledging the cameras there. And probably sending shout outs to Nine. viewers or watching this Six. match Hold in Nigeria Hold on the Hold internet. Hold in. Is that anything again? Guys, don't kick it back. Eh? It goes towards it. Okay. Head towards the prop. Don't kick it out and let go to the bar. Crouch. Bind. Set. Bowling. Morocco just carrying the ball there. The ball is loose. It is played out. Can Morocco end this match Back with Nigeria. a flourish? Advantage over. Lamarty with the pop pass there. The tackle coming through, just making things difficult. Moroccan player did have a player, did have a foot into touch, and that is it at full time. Nigeria with the 19 5 results. They claim seventh place at the Africa Cup Sevens. Coming up next will be that match between Zimbabwe and Tunisia. The winner of the upcoming match will claim fifth place, but as it stands, Nigeria 19. Congratulations to. Morocco 5.